Uh, I'm gonna make Bass wait on my ass while I get this car spray painted. <laughs> I've been meaning to get this shit done. Well, how can I be? Hey, do you uh, spray paint fucking cars at the tuna shop? We do, but I'm currently not available to do that. Uh, what are you doing? Uh, I can't really explain that. Uh, but I need you to explain it to me. I Look, I will pay you an extremely large sum of money to go do this now. I, I can't do that now. Why can't you do this now? I'm currently busy. Okay, is there somebody else that isn't a useless fuck that works at this shop? You could possibly go check. I don't even know where this shop's located. It's on... Give me one second. It's on in and I can Signal only Street get my car spray painted here. No, you can get your car painted at uh, any other mechanic shop like Hayes or the Hayes that's all they the way spray up in paint? Uh, Sandy. Yeah. Hayes. What the fuck is Hayes? Hayes is a mechanic shop over by spray Great Ocean Highway. Car. Yeah. All right. All right. You missed out on like $5 million. Have a good one. Right, have a good day. Okay. Hayes? Oh, since when? Since when? Did I just call this guy? I don't think I did. Hello? Hey, do you do you spray paint cars? Uh, yes, but I'm not currently available at the moment. God, you useless fuck. is this now huh? hello are you available I am currently not available now. you're currently not available I will fucking bomb the tuna shop all right didn't you just I'm, call me? I'm, I'm, I'm who the fuck are you Ah, oh, shit, I did call that guy. <laughs> okay, I called that guy. Who the fuck is this? I, okay, this is the guy I gotta call. <laughs> this guy, okay. Holy shit, mechanic businesses fucking suck. Nobody's ever available. Yo, yo. Do you spray paint vehicles? Uh, no, I don't. Don't. Do you where do they spray paint vehicles? Spray paint vehicles like yeah. uh you know like the like the change the color of your vehicle? Yeah, yeah. Uh tuna shop. That's it? Yes sir. Why the fuck did a tuna shop guy tell me that it can happen at Hayes? That guy's smoking dick. I ain't even going front, man. Yeah, no, nah, it's a, it's just a tuna shop. Uh, all right. Well, you, what, what's your name? Uh, Roberto. Roberto. R Roberto. What Wait, do you no, do no, for no. a living, Roberto? Robert. Roberto. I don't yeah, give a yeah. fuck. I'm a senator. I ain't doing that shit. What the fuck do you okay, do for okay, a living? Fair enough. Fair enough. You know, I work over at Autos. I work at Rooster. You know, uh, I'm an event planner. I manage. What game are you doing shows right now? XTC. I actually headed out to Sanguine Isle. I'm. Uh, on the beach, I'm about to smoke myself some fatties, some cones, you know what I'm saying? Lay up on the beach, find myself a couple of Where are you currently at in the city? I'm, I'm, on, I'm on the island. I'm oh, you're on the island. island. Oh, yeah, 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 right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. You have yeah. a good one. Hey, you too, mate. Peace, peace. They're all on the island. You got in the wrong car, miss. You got in the wrong car, miss. Hey, hey Crane, I'm watching that. the That's cops do shit. All right, I'm I'm getting my damn car fixed, and uh, I told Bass to meet us at City Hall. All right, uh, yeah, we're gonna wait on the other senator. I don't care how long it takes. I'm going only with him. I yeah, will right. cancel the meeting sense. if he doesn't show up. I gotta yeah, get I this you. car fixed. Uh, also, the tuna shop. Uh, 
here's Empty. the thing. I already went there to get my car fixed. All right, well, what's the likelihood that I could send a missile into that bitch? Like, logistics? Do we have uh, any spare missiles sitting around? I think you guys bought a bunch. I think you that's bought right. jets well, and missiles uh, for You PD. like my logistics guy, so that's why I'm asking. All right, I mean, we could we could ask PD. We could ask Bash. Shit, they got jets. All right. All right, I'll let you know. Look, they just weren't available at my nearest convenience, so I'm thinking yeah. about bombing them. Hey, that's you know, how you all dictatorship. I mean, never mind. I'm here. No, all right. Hey, Bass, how many missiles do we have in stock? I need I need this car fixed. Uh, I guess, okay, uh, just give us a moment. Right right wasn't ready at the senator's uh, earliest convenience, so he's inquiring uh, what missiles we have on hand to maybe teach them a lesson. <laughs> maybe. Okay, I'll let him know. Thank you. We probably have enough to shoot down an aircraft, but not enough to bomb the building. All right. So, yeah. <laughs> what the fuck? Why do I have Milky Mountains on me? What? <laughs> what the fuck? What in God's name? You still driving Abdul's piece of shit, huh? Yeah. I think it just sends a message. Yeah, it does. It does. God damn. I think you're right, though. We definitely need Bros. Because Bass sounded sober, and I ain't trying to listen to him. Pretty good on this. You just need like body and engine, or like just mostly all high. Oh, this one's this one's the senators. Just make it showroom. Okay. Is this Bob and not Bass that I have in my phone as chief? I don't know who's in my phone as what. Um. Hey, hey is this Chief Bass? Uh, this is Colonel. I got promoted. Oh, you got a promotion. Yeah, I got a promotion. Oh, well. By all means. You know, what, no, no, what'd you bum, do where you at? Uh, I'm not meeting uh, you until Barossi's around. Where are you? Uh, I'm doing, I'm, I'm doing Senator things until Barossi's available. Oh, so he's not around right now? The other one? He, he's, he's not here this second, though. Okay. I'm waiting for him. Would you like to meet somewhere? I got the mayor with me right now. Have you met him before? You know I don't give a is. fuck about some random ass mayor. I see, okay. okay. Why would I ever yeah. care about the mayor? I would let him know, don't you worry. Uh, well, I, I thought you that. requested the meeting. I, I never get any emails, I never get anything from the mayor. I thought you requested the meeting. No, I did, I did. There's, there's uh, things we talk about. So what, did you request the mayor as well? Oh, uh, the mayor needs to be present for this meeting because he's involved in this conversation. He's a glorified about. secretary for the Senate, so I, I don't think we need the mayor present because the Senate's already there. We need the mayor. <laughs> yes, we do. <laughs> it's not, I'm talking to Senator Big Bum right now. Uh, the mayor is definitely needed. His um, expertise on that subject and any talk about and his input, I think, will be um, much needed in this conversation. Right, so what, what what all do you even need to speak with me about and the other senator? A um, couple things, obviously. Um, Little Moscow, Border Patrol and Customs, the island, and a uh, couple things I prefer not to have on the phone about. All right, so... Okay, hold on. Let me walk away from a crowd of people. So, all right, you need to speak about Border Patrol? Yeah. All right, Border Patrol... Jotted. Uh, you need to speak about what else? 
Uh, customs. Customs, all right. Check. A uh, little Moscow and the Russians. You got that? Yeah, all three jotted down. Okay, perfect. Anything else? Uh, probably a couple of things that I, I got to think of. Um, they'll come to mind when I get to the meeting. Uh, all right. Well, I'm away from people. So, do you want to tell me what you were hesitant to tell me? I'll tell you in person. Fine. Well, uh, let me know. Why where not to meet, just though. tell we're me ready. over the phone? I prefer not to talk over the phone right now. All right, but I need to jot it down so I know what's on my schedule. And if I don't have it jotted down for my schedule, then I'm going to leave. Well, those three should be enough then. You don't want to talk about right. anything else? No, that should be it for If now. we stray away from these three topics, I'm leaving the meeting. Like, what is the big deal with just telling me over the phone? Of course, Senator. Of course, of course. That should be enough. The, what's the big deal of telling me over the phone? That should be enough, Senator. Let you, me know no, no, no. You don't tell me what's enough. I really appreciate your time. Thank you. Uh, you're not going to hang up the phone. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Senator. Thank you. You can't just keep saying thank you to me. That, that doesn't work. <laughs> Let me know where to pick you up. You'd, I have my own vehicle. Okay. Anyway, perfect. my point is... My, my point here is... You clearly have something on your mind, but you do not want to tell me over the phone. Is it because you're worried about the phone being compromised? Uh, yes, the okay. Russians could be listening in. I do not have anybody listening into my phone. I have a secure line. I'm the fucking Senate. Well, I don't. Yeah, but my my phone makes your phone better. <laughs> Senator, that's all I have to talk about. Thank you. Uh... Is there who's leading? Who's the leader of Russia nowadays? I'll, um, I don't know. I'm not sure, honestly. I think um, does it really matter? Maybe not. Maybe it does. Do we all really matter when you think about it? We all do. No, we don't. Nobody matters but the Senate. Right. Nobody matters but the Senate. Yes, sir. <laughs> You guys know anybody that uh, that runs the tuna shop? By any chance? Be sure to let Bundy know as well. Uh, I think it might still be Eddie, but he's not been around enough. No, I mean like who operates? Like, is there anybody here that oh. works there? Mm, not from what I know. And you can't just spray paint my car? No, unfortunately. Let's call him up on yellow pages, bro. I didn't think of that. That's revolutionary. Thank you. <laughs> Maybe go to the tuna shop. <laughs> What's your name? Huh? What's your name? Ready. Say it again. Ready. I can't hear you with your mask on, sir. Ready. Freddy? Yeah. Senator Davis. Sounds good, bro. Nice to meet you, Senator Davis. You like purple? Yeah. What's your favorite thing about the color purple? Paula Gang. Your favorite thing about the color purple is Paula Gang. Yeah. 
Now, I think he... you're laughing because you know how dumb that sentence sounds here in the back. <laughs> Am I wrong? Yeah. No, you're not wrong. Yeah, okay. I do okay. sound like a dumbass. Sweet. Got any alcohol on you? Nah, I don't, bro. All right. How the fuck do I? How the fuck do I do this shit nowadays? People can't use this shit anymore. Damn. the PD guys lined up for the investigation info dump uh, I told them they're on deck after bass whenever he wants to talk about all right sounds good all right Brosie awake Uh, I don't. I don't even remember if I have his number saved. No, I have. I have you and uh, Mister Fled to fucking God knows where. I ain't got Barosi. I don't even think I have any of the other senators' numbers saved in my phone. Well, if you were a ninety-eight-year-old senator, where would you be? Uh, in a casino. <laughs> yeah, that's a good point. <laughs> May stop the social security office first. Bank. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> we need like a task force to find this fucking guy. Hello. I'm with uh, Senator Davis. We're waiting on Barosi. What's going on? You want us to come to City Hall? All right, I'll make the request, but you know, Senators, they do what they want. All right. Uh, Bass is trying to, like, dictate the meeting. He said he wants us at City Hall in the judges' chambers. Yeah, that's not happening. Yeah, what's, what's going on with him? I don't know, but now we're going to make this as long as possible. Yeah, okay. Bro said, nah, yeah. <laughs> Can I grab your state ID real quick? So yeah. My state ID is number one. All right. Hey, what's up, Mr. Crane? Hello. What do you want to do? Go drinking or what? I'm going to find Senator Barossi. All right. Well, there's whiskey and beer in the glove box. You want to tie one on? Perfect. Do you, do you know anybody that, like, uh, you trust to not be a normal resident of this city, a.k.a. moronic and doomed, to be a driver so I don't have to drive and I could just drink? Uh, let me look at the yellow pages. Depends who's awake. Oh, you know what? Maximilian Angel is the perfect guy. He's a deputy mayor. He's a straight arrow. Doesn't do anything. He's a bartender. Oh, well, it sounds perfect to me. Hey, Max. Uh, listen. Uh, how much for you to be a chauffeur for an evening? Yeah, okay. We'll call it 100. Where are you at? What are you doing? 
Okay, uh, where in Vinewood? Uh, I'll meet you at Tequila Law. Alright, bye. Alright, uh, Tequila Law Market. That's where our driver is. Chat, we're three subs away from the next level of the hype train. That's a lot of people. All right, chauffeur, I need you to protect Hello? me. Hello. Chauffeur, protect oh. me. I'm a senator. Uh, 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 okay, I, I, I'll try my best to. Uh, oh, God. Uh, oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Keep driving. Uh, okay, okay. I'm going to keep driving. Oh, God. <laughs> all right, perfect. All right, we're going to drive my car. Hop in. Uh, all right, dude. May I say good choice in car? Uh, it's former, uh, former mayors. Oh, right. Oh, Abdul, right? Yep. Oh, he told me he had one of these ones. Yep. Uh, where would you like to go, sir? Uh, PD. I need equipment. Sure thing. And do you want me to drive speed limit or just go crazy? You are the senator after all. Uh, this is full speed. Full speed? You've got yep. it. Nothing I do is even questioned nor illegal. I fully understand. I own this state. I mean, you are the senator. It may interest you in any snacks while you wait. We have dino tendies and fish crackers. Why the fuck would I want a dinosaur tender? Do you think I, I'm I... some kind of prehistoric man? Oh, no. No, no, no. I you just think, think I cut out dinosaur dinosaurs shapes. and make food out of them? Who the fuck oh, do no, no, you no, no, think no, no, I no, am? No, well, 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 it's, it's just regular chicken nugget. It's just, you know, cutting the shape oh, of yeah, the dinosaur. I'm, with Davis right now. I'm not a fucking child. I don't eat chicken nuggets. Are you kidding me? I eat fucking 12 course meals. Uh, my apologies, sir. <laughs> Chat, we're, we're a minute from yeah, the next on the hype train. Three subs away. talk about with that. We'll be by in a minute. We're coming there anyway. All right. Hey, good news, bros. He's at the fucking PD, so two birds. Perfect. Uh, oh, um, do we park in the, the PD lot? Uh, he's parking on the sidewalk. All right, dude. Two subs away. Oh, there's Barosi. All right. Here we go. Should I stay in the car? I don't care. Yep, sure thing. Oh, cool. Thanks. Get out of the man. Somebody's here. Somebody's here. It's just, that's how it is. Like it's. That's not holding. Turned off. Hello, Barosi. Howdy, partner. How are you doing? Doing good. I just visited the uh, area f uh, 69. Have you been there before? Several times. Okay, all right. All right. Uh, did they give you any of the toys to play with? All the time. I've got a collection at my house. Oh, absolutely. I love the hat. Nice. Thank you. Thank you for showing Ty's up, always um, looking good as usual. Oh, thank you, sir. I don't know if you remember me, sir, Colonel Sam Bass. 
Yeah. Say police. Well, I heard the explosion, so um, I thought I mean... it was Colonel Sanders. No, 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 no. I, I don't sure remember you know. Well, actually, I waited for you to. He's uh, we meet you here. Where should we meet? Where should we have this conversation? Isn't there meant to be uh, more officers around? No. Um, just us. No, they're coming later. We're two separate meetings. I'm gonna be me. Mm, okay. Uh, well, should we go somewhere more formal? We should. I was thinking the city hall or the aircraft carrier. What? Or we can have. Why would we go to the down. aircraft carrier, sir? Unless we're going to bomb that embassy, I don't know why the fuck we would go there. Well, um, there's a conversation needs to be had on the aircraft carrier. That makes a lot of sense. Why we're having it there? Okay. Okay. Fine. How do we get there? I was hoping you can guide us. You brought that I'm tank, right? I'm a fucking right? senator, not an aircraft driver. I drive a tank. That's it. See. <laughs> you put your foot down and it goes. Well, I got a helicopter. Well, that could work. Uh, can I park the tank somewhere safe? Yeah, probably inside Mission PD. Uh, okay, hey, Bass, when are we going to ride together? Hopefully one day. One Real. day. We're going to kill all the Russians, Bass. We will, we will. Colonel, could you open up the gates for me, sir? Absolutely. All right, see you around. Oops, central locking was on. You know how to fly? I do not know. All right. I don't need a co-pilot. I just need somebody to fly. Just need from uh from here to the aircraft carrier. Oh. Is, he... Is it not not open? Is that an Abrams? Tower eight away. Huh. Next old the train. Good thing. I'll just park it here. Surely nobody's stupid enough to steal this. You'd right? be surprised. Uh, Surely. You'll be surprised. You'll be surprised, but... I mean, the dumb citizens of Los Santos would not know how to operate a tank, Senator Burrow, so let's... Oh, yes. Right, right, right. What's up, y'all? How y'all doing? All right, come this way, please. This is, uh, phase one, Bundy, so we'll need you for phase two. But he can bundy can tag along. That's fine. He can be part of this conversation. All right. Close these doors. Uh, Crane, Bundy, you guys need to go with Anita. I'll take the the first air one. I'll take uh, the mayor and the two senators with me. That way, cause we got more than four. All right. We'll take Crane in all helicopters. So it'll be Bass, Crane, me, and Senator Barosi. How about you three can go with Anita. I'll, I'll stick with the mayor. Who's Anita? Uh, she's upstairs. All right. Perfect. You go. Need to watch your twenty. No, no, you should back him to show PD. Need to. I tell you, Area Sixty Nine has some cool shit. Check this out. Those Russians didn't stand a chance. Oh, they gave they gave you one of those. Yes, yes, you yes. Get a spare one. Uh, I believe I do. <laughs> yes. Why you come with us? Perfect. Can take one more with us. I thought we were maxed out at four on this one, Colonel. Yeah, no, we are. Nina should be coming right now. Okay. Right. <laughs> yeah, you're gonna pick up Bundy and the Chief Justice. Make sure Biddy. Uh, is there any reason you haven't asked me to bomb Little Moscow yet, uh, sir? Well, that's going to be part of the conversation we're going to have as well, so, um, a couple things we talked about. We have about, some so. great aerial drones. Fantastic shit. They won't even see it coming. Well, I, I would love to use one, sir, against a little mouse. No, I'm you. not going to let you use it. You're not the fucking military, Mr. Boss. You have a military right, relax. Right there. Excuse me. I do have a military rank, to be fair, the colonel. 
Yes, yeah, right, right, but it's uh, the state police ranking, sir. Not yeah, in yeah, the military. Yeah, you're, you're doing false valor right now. That's illegal. I lost that though, but it can be. It's illegal if I say so. That is a fact. That's true. How is, um, what's that guy's name? Who's that sheriff? Oh, Sheriff Toretti? Yeah, he's doing great. How's, um... Sheriff Toretti? He's currently on vacation right now, spending some time in, I think, uh, Honolulu. Interesting. How's, uh, what's that other guy's name? The, the real loud and obnoxious one. Oh, Kyle Pratt. Yeah, he works for me right now. He's a trooper. Oh, yes. He was a good police officer. <laughs> He's a trooper now, huh? Maybe he could take your spot. <laughs> <laughs> hey, if you say so. That wasn't a joke. That was not a joke. How's, uh, how's Commissioner, uh, how's the Commissioner doing? Commissioner, what was that guy's name? Lance Malton, yeah, he's just a trooper now, too. <laughs> you see a pattern? Just out of curiosity, uh, why is it we going to the ship out here? Well, uh, I'll explain why. There's Christopher Coyne. He's not a senator. Uh, is there a terrorist we need to throw in like Bin Laden? <laughs> well, <laughs> something like that might happen actually in Los Santos. And um, we're here to talk about it. Okay. They beat us out here. You're not much of a pilot, sir. Oh, I was just talking and flying. Right, right. Can't really multitask right. very well sometimes. Copy that. And then I'll let you know when we need you all through one, alright? Oh, Ahoy, Captain Moose Spirit. I need a, a private room. I got the senators with me. Yeah, absolutely. Just uh, right up there. Alright, perfect. Senators, follow me. Gentlemen. Uh, Hello, sir. Is that man uh, a pirate? Or he's a fan of Johnny Depp? No, actually, he's a captain. Oh, interesting. <laughs> Why you got us out of here, Bash? It's cold as hell. Yeah, it is cold. Don't you worry, I get that heat warmer upstairs. We're asking about missiles right there. Need some. All right, Over. well, there you go. After you, Mayor. All right, well, should be uh, warm enough for y'all. It's not too bad. So, um, there's a couple things I'll bring up from my side. Yes. There's um, just a general state of Los Santos and everything's been going on. Um, roughly last week, has it been a week so far? When was the last time? When was the time that Michael was so caught? incompetent? Bundy, I'm trying to remember, Senator. Was it last uh, week? Yeah, someone was brought into custody nine days ago, I believe. Nine days ago, yes. Nine days ago, my, the super terrorist Michael Simone was caught by the Unified Police Department. Then he was transported to the penitentiary where he's being placed in max sec. Shortly afterwards, the next day, the Russians, retaliation for Michael Simone being caught, launched a full assault on Los Santos, damaging and hurting a lot of civilians, using F-14s, Apache helicopters, drone strikes, and so on. So, with that being said, I'm requesting the help of the Senate to send a message loud and clear back to the Russians that we will not tolerate 
any attack on Los Santos, and we'll do anything we can to fight back. Well, I have been thinking about the possibilities, and the sad thing is we can't nuclear strike our own city, so we'll have to use napalm or something. Oh. Maybe some napalm. I was thinking bulldozers. We demolish your buildings. We should definitely mm. bomb it first. Well, in yeah, some capacity. With, with all due respect, 100 feet away from that building is Mr. LPD. That's our the police HQ. So. Right, yeah, right, that's right. That's what the napalm is for. It, you know, right, doesn't right. explode. And if I don't uh, want my officers getting hurt in the process while I was trying to. Oh, down. no, no. I was trying to sh sh drone strikes for. Very, very accurate. And just because it wasn't that good when we uh, invaded Iraq and, you know, killed civilians there, doesn't mean we'll do the same in our own country. If I uh, if I may, Colonel, uh, that entire compound is just buildings on the outside. We could use the improvised explosives, the uh, the, the big planted ones, knock all those buildings down and level the whole goddamn block. Something like that would be great, Senators. Yes, 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 yes. A message back to Lil Moscow that you can't be fucking around in our... Playground. So mm, we don't tolerate that. Am I understanding this correctly? That a super terrorist was caught, and so Russia decided to back the super terrorist. Well, so we believe he was the main source of um, weaponry being smuggled from Russia into Los Santos. A lot of the weaponry you see in the hands of criminals are Russian-made, and the biggest supplier of those weaponry was Michael Simon at the time. So the guy who was making a lot of money from them just got caught, and now that source of income is gone. They're not very happy. Hmm, interesting. That's strange. Um, how long ago did the weapons stop coming in exactly? Um, it's been a year and a half now. Um, I would say majority of the weaponry has stopped coming as far as class two, maybe four or five months now. But um, then roughly the same time you had a raid on uh, the art gallery or what it was, you found weapons in there too. Correct, yes. So there was a massive raid on the VLC underground. There's tunnels inside. <laughs> we found a weapon bench that manufactured class twos. Yes, yes. Maybe they were also terrorists. Well, they did try to kidnap the mayor at one point. That was when Mickey S was the mayor. That's how we found out the place. We were able to use the um, 5G towers to try and the location, and then from there, push for a search warrant to search the property. Um, you're right, right. Just out of curiosity, who uh, who is this man to the right of me? That is the current mayor, Lang Buddha. Yeah, no, Mickey, Mickey the mayor. is no longer the mayor. No, oh, Mickey's no longer the mayor. I found well, out yesterday. Times have changed. Yeah. No what longer a game. change that is. Yeah. Mickey was a good mayor. He never bothered me once. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, the streets, how long have the Russians been in the city for, Mr. Boss? Six, seven months, at least. <laughs> Is there a reason I haven't got an email in six or seven months about Russians invading our city? Well, that's because one of the centers at the time was Because you're incompetent? No. Sorry, with yes. all respect. Yes. The opposite yes. incompetent. If there are Russians in the city flying around fighter jets and I haven't been informed, I believe that might be a little bit of incompetency, sir. Just a little bit. You don't think maybe the military should have gotten involved and blown these guys off the map as soon as they entered the city? We even gave them the goddamn facility over there. The other senator. The one that's not here Excuse anymore. Excuse me. There used to be three of you. Yes. One of them was acting as the ambassador between Little Moscow and us. He was handling most of the relationship. That's why I was not involved in informing you anything, because at the time I assumed that you all were talking. Oh, no. We only talk when absolutely necessary. Understand. Well, well, well. I guess me and the other senators will have to have a talk about Little Moscow and what we'll do with it, what sort of explosives we'll use, when we'll do it, how we'll do it. But I don't know if that sends the right message. We're only blowing up a building. Maybe we should get the terrorist, Mr. Simone, and throw him off the ship like Bin Laden. Yeah, I agree with that. I, I think maybe we uh, we send them off the fucking ship, send the fucking message that way. Oh, we, we do it while he's alive. I want to make him walk the plank. Yes, we'll tie a few bricks to his feet and throw him over the fucking side of the boat, yes. Yeah, but what is this, this about us? Let's just swim to uh, the Lawless Island uh, down south. Swim? How will he swim if he's chained to bricks? It'll Are sink, my friends. Oh, okay. My apologies. Yes, yes. Maybe even cut his head off on the way down. 
I'm not sure if it's a good idea. <laughs> I'm gonna send the wrong message to the people back, uh, you know, in Russia. No, I think that, that sounds. I think that sends exactly the right message, actually. Yes, yes. Go to Los Santos, fuck around, and find out. It's a good message. Well, not because it's a war the, crime. Uh, say that. The uh, the Russian incursion actually began at the time that Michael Smith was believed to be dead. He died on the uh, uh, sorry October first, and the Russians uh, took over that territory on the eighth. Interesting, interesting, interesting. Hmm. It was nothing but a foothold for them, basically, to enter Los Santos and start to gain in power and influence. <laughs> so yeah, um, whenever y'all ready, I'm ready. I do believe it's time to go on offensive. And um, as far as Michael Simone, that's something that um, Ranger Bundy can inform me more about. Uh, we can talk more about that or continue to the next topic. Let's go to the next topic because I think Knight needs to be here for the Simone conversation. Okay. Well, next topic is um, well, if you look behind me, you see a vast sea, an ocean, wide and blue. However, to the very east, and I point that way, there's a new solid. They don't state really see anything actually. It's quite dark out there. There's no frontal lights on the ship. You don't I see can't... that boat to the right? Oh yes, I see that boat out there. Yes. That is the Marines are holding and protecting the coastal guard and board of Los Santos and um, the sovereign state of San Quentin Island. Um, we worry that there's going to be a lot of smugglers going going in and out of um, the state of San Andreas, bringing either illegal contraband, weaponry, or drugs. And uh, we wanted some sort of legislation that gives us the ability to perform customers, customs on the border, maybe draw some sort of line where if they pass that line, between the territory of San Queen Island and the state of San Andreas. They're subject yeah, to an open to uh, search of the belongings to make sure they're not bringing any illegal contraband weaponry or um, obviously CDS. Okay, let me look here. No, contraband, yes, you know this, I mean, it's a, you said it's a sovereign country or, or island. What is it? Is it a country? I believe it's a sovereign state. That's what it said in legislation. Sovereign state, okay, well, yes, yes, yes. If it is sovereign, then yes, uh, I guess we shall be putting some customs uh, aboard. How exactly would you like that to be processed, then? Um, anybody exiting the island, entering back to the state of Los Santos, is subject to search upon uh, the cross, the waters. When they make it to land, then the rules and the laws of Los Santos apply to them, and they would need probable cause to search them. For your info, Senators, I've got a meeting scheduled with a... What's that pirate fuck's name? Thatch? Moosebeard? Yeah, Moosebeard. Uh, he's got some ideas for how he'd like the legislation to work, so I can kick that up to you guys. We already submitted a legislation to uh, to the Senators on the customs, like, two or three days ago. From I Thatch? Never received it. No. Oh, well, maybe you should check your emails. <laughs> Either way, how do, we, how do we make this happen, though? Is it something that will be forced always, or is it just something that if they get caught, they would be searched? How exactly do you see it work? Well, we know um, to leave the island, you need to use a boat or to swim or to use some sort of means of transportation, right? Always saying anybody yeah, who's that's... leaving from that island and entering the, the waters of the city of San Andreas is subject to arrest. However, if we don't see them on the, on the waters leaving the island, we don't spot them, and they make it to land on shore, then the same rules and laws apply to them, like probable cause needed to search them and arrest them, or see what they yes, have. Yes, yes, yes. I mean, it sounds reasonable. Um, I, I do have the documentation that I can go over and uh, double-check that, but uh, something like that is very, very reasonable, yes. Okay. And um, also, if it possible, to maybe give the PD the ability to um, form some sort of port authority. Um, that way, people interested in, um, you know, doing the Coastal Guard or being part of the customs can um, be out here on the waters doing police work and trying to catch any smugglers who are moving shit from one state to another. Yes. Uh, we also might need to add in some logging for the flight record so you can see who is uh, coming and going uh, on a constant basis and have an understanding of, you know, who may or may not be uh, doing dirty things if there's dirty things on the island. 
I see. I mean, I'm not. We're not in need of um, you know, um, suspicious calls or pings. I don't think we need that in the PC. No, no, just... no. Just documentation of flight logs. Sir. Oh, okay. Yeah, I think Perfect. what he's I mean... trying to say is like an option for you to go down and see you who's actually could, like, taking flights over, so you guys could go see who's actually left the country. Oh, I see. Okay, so it's some sort of like yeah, sure. the documentation. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Exactly. Exactly. All right. That makes sense. Maybe we could do a passport system, and they can be revoked if uh, somebody's, you know, uh, put in jail. Maybe uh, their passport is revoked for a certain amount of time. It's quite a costly investment. Who knows what other islands could show up? Yeah, you never know. I mean, we just want to make sure we're ready. We don't get ready for when it happens. We stay ready. Yes. And then, um, lastly, um, I'm not sure how to get this kind of sorted, but PD's been requesting for the ability to, um, seize vehicles or properties and having some sort of state auction to where we can generate revenue as, um, we don't want to be dependent on the mayor's office to be asking for uh, money from them. We should be asking for the minimum, but if we want to achieve more and be more self-sufficient, there should be other ways through seizing evidence and trying to auction it back to uh, the civilian population while also getting a large sum of cash out of it and dividing among the PD. Um, well, I suppose if it's going to go through uh, current civilian businesses, it would make sense, but... Uh... I'm unsure if it was just through PD or something that it would be uh, good for the city. So, uh, if you could sort out somebody that is, uh, you know, business oriented uh, within the city, I'm sure we could uh, have something uh, fleshed out. Yes. Okay, perfect. And then, uh, lastly, um, maybe passing a new law for speed limit in the ocean, depending on the distance you're away from shore. So maybe we can conduct traffic stops out in the ocean of people traveling back and forth. What the and fuck? Uh, well, I mean, if there's, so from my understanding, if somebody's out in the ocean, uh, you should be able to do the fisheries checks and search their boats and whatnot anyway. So uh, really, they should be yielding without the speed. Hey, you hey, don't you put a radar on your fucking boat. Yeah, you don't need anything. You don't need shit, Bass. You already got the fishing checks. Okay, all right. Then, Anybody um, who can even be suspected as being in the act of fishing or hunting can have their shit searched at any time. Okay, good enough for me then. Just making sure I'm just covering my bases, that's all. Because um, there's going to be a lot of water activity happening here pretty soon. So I think, yes, with all the customs and stuff, there'll be, uh, we sh you'll have a lot of information on these people. Yeah. I mean, hell, you'll have a, you'll have a log of people that are going over there, and then you'll be able to... Uh, be able to when people come back you have every reason to search them so don't think All you right. need to pull somebody over for going 36 and a 35 on the ocean okay um perfect then um i don't think i got anything else to talk about i think i filled you in as far as my issues but yeah is there any questions you have for me um no um no that's, that's, that sounds great <laughs> thank you all right well bundy it's your show is night awake? I do not see him on duty currently. Topic we're going back to is Michael Simone. And um, I'm a little bit confused about the, the, the hearing we're having here today. Is this something that you're it's looking at? not a hearing. This ain't a hearing. Okay, okay. So this is completely like extrajudicial. This is the Senate wanting to speak to the investigators because, hell, you know, they might just decide to get Mo this fucker. So, you know. If they want to hear shit, they can hear shit. Oh, there is something I want to talk about since we got some time. This happened two days ago, and I was in charge of this, so feel free to get mad at me, if you like, Senator. But can we talk about um, the shipping containers and the, the policies behind them? And maybe you can explain it from your perspective as far as what you believe should happen so I can have a better understanding as far as how to proceed going forward. Because I thought I was going by the guidelines that we had in place. For, um... Right, right, right. So, um, I believe there is a guideline to do with stashes on business properties, but I believe a stash would, you know, cons I'm not even sure if stashes, are, are they still around? Are they still a thing? Yeah, there's still some out there. 
Either way, uh, the way I see it is how it works in the rest of America. If you want to enter any sort of property with uh, the intention to search anything, you should have a warrant. It's that simple. Fair, if there but... is somebody that you can't uh, forward the warrant to, that doesn't matter. You can still do it once it's signed. If it's if it's not possible to pass it on to them, you should still be able to search uh, the, the property once it's signed. Okay, let me ask you this. But who am I searching that property? Who does the property belong to at that point? Because... I was under the assumption it was uh, public property at the time, but I saw otherwise because when I asked... Well, public Randall, property would... What, uh, that's like uh, a park or government owned, really. That's that's the public uh, space. But if it's a yeah. industrial uh, property or a housing property, it is private property. I see. Okay, so you're saying because of where it's location and be, based in, on the a... housing district, sorry, the industrial district, it, it means... it belongs to somebody that land's owned by somebody somebody else's business okay exactly i don't want you going out to a farm uh, in the middle of uh nowhere and finding you know 73 people chained up in a basement uh, just because you felt like going in there for no reason because i don't want to go I, that would be illegal <laughs> okay and then well let me ask you this in the search warrant for example I'm pushing for a search warrant of said container that belongs yes. on private property. Who am I sending the search warrant? Is it to a local or is it to the person I catch going in and out of that place? Well, if you see somebody going in and out of uh, of the place and uh, the, it's on the property that is owned by a local, you don't have to file it to anybody. But, but in the it will warrant, be passed on automatically so you to would, the owner of the property. So you would, so best, so what you would do is you would write uh, the place to be searched. You would write container, for example, the one that incorrectly searched based on my authorization the other day. Lab in training, whose property was being searched. You would write owner of train yard east of Orchard Villa. Doesn't need to be a specific person. See, see, see. Just okay, okay, owner okay, okay. of train yard. So, yeah, no, 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 I understand that. When okay, you're that makes sense. also so, going to raid a property, if you have a raid warrant for a property, you don't necessarily need to serve it unless they're on the property while you're uh, raiding them. I understand that. I'm saying for the application of the search warrant when the judge is asking yeah. who is being raided, for example, right? When we thought the yes, 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 yes. I mean, if it's a locally owned right? business, you, you would note that business to the best of your ability. And I'm asking these questions because I want to make a PD announcement about it. So this does happen again. At least officers know what necessary steps they have to take and how to fill out the paperwork so on the same page and the easy well, the easy uh, way to go through it bass is uh as barossi just said to you uh and as i said to you the other day a lot of these stashes right they may be large boxes but they are still boxes okay whereas a crate has a door it could function as a hiding place for a human being etc so a place that has a door that is on property private whether you know the owner or not is treated like a home okay all right perfect i think i got a text message from brian knight so you just need to consider it like anything else when you're searching a person you get your pc it doesn't matter no, no, I, everything I works sure under the done. same uh, s same sort of thing. If something was laying in the open, like a stash, and you walk past through public visuals and you saw something, uh, and somebody pulled a gun out of it or something like that, you'd be able to search it right there and then. Of course, of course. I'm just making sure that I understand um, the ruling on it and the perspective y'all have, so at least we're on the same page. So if it does happen again, I know how to um, deal with it properly and make sure that the right procedure is applied. Brian Knight is in his way. We can wait here or we can meet him in Los Santos. Uh, well, I don't mind. We can always go in there if need be. How far is he out? Let me check my GPS. It would probably... The sun is would rising. He looks so beautiful out there. Where? He should be here. I told him to come here. I don't see him. Is he on duty? He, he is be off duty. not... Oh, he's he is now, actually. No, oh, he's on duty now. Duty. Where is his call sign? 221. By the way, Brian Knight is also part of the state. So is um, Jeffrey Bundy here. A lot of fine yes. officers that do amazing police work are within the state. Um, you know, uh, 
jurisdiction. So we got the best of the best here in house. I I didn't ask. I don't think I did either, but either way, just remember, the basics of a police officer is uh, searching with PC. I'm sure you guys can comprehend it. Oh, don't you worry. At the end yeah. of the day, if you can't mm. serve the warrant, who cares? Just fucking go and do it. Understood. They can get it later. So, uh, I believe... Uh, I see I think... coming out here. Yeah, yes, I think yes. I think he's in the helicopter with Lovesick right now. They should be here any moment. Okay, on. marvelous. Uh, All right. Perfect. Any other business we got to deal with while we have bass here? Uh, I got some food. If y'all need some food, yeah, I'll I got take plenty some food. food. Yeah. We got uh, supplies on the aircraft carrier for the Marine unit, so you go on the ground. Yeah, so Davis, I got a couple of cars I seized. Yep, I'll take those for you. PD's been up my ass about wanting to buy them off us. Oh, speaking of that, Crane, cargo bomb. Yeah. Can we buy one of those for the um, for the the PD? Yeah, we seized stuff. this uh, car, Davis, from this asshole Francis, and uh, it's like a S plus plus some kind of sports car. I don't fucking know. And uh, PD's all hot to trot to spend a bunch of their budget money on buying the car from us. So I I told them that's up to you guys. Is somebody's alarm going, or is that the microwave? That might be. Uh, no, that's it's a bunch of cops getting oh, shot. Is that my life alert? I'm off. fine. I don't uh, know why that's going on. The goddamn Russians. Do I need to get the tank no, out? No, it's a house robber. It's a burglary gone wrong. Son of a bitch up in the violent hills. Jesus Christ. Five police officers shot over a robbery. <sighs> Sounds about right. Out. This is America. You might need bigger guns. Well, speaking of that. When we were uh, invited to um, San Queen Island, the sovereign state, just to the east, they did have big, big guns, AK-74, RPGs, big silencers, big guns. And they also had military trucks used well, so. A oh, that don't worry. People... If things get out of hand, just this time email me when the terrorists are here, okay? Just yeah. email me. It's a simple process. Hey, nice. Hey. Sir. Hold it. hey. All, All right, right, so uh, what is with half the police officers having an eye mission? Oh, mine got oh, shot out eye. by mine got shot out by oh, Michael. Between so. them, they got two eyes. No, no, I I have both eyes. This is for uh, shooting. Oh, I see. Hey, you swap Cross the eye patch when the no, no, you swap the eye when uh, it gets dark out. Oh, oh right, right, right. So just so we're on the same page here, uh, Knight Bundy Best. This is not a uh, judicial hearing of any sort. This is not mm -hmm. a formal procedure. This is in no way any kind of court proceeding. This is simply an extrajudicial matter where the senators have asked you to come and talk to them about some things that have occurred in their jurisdiction. Because, mm -hmm. uh, you know, they have ultimate authority. So they may just decide to throw this fucker off the side of a building. Who knows? So uh, the floor is yours. Basically tell us who this fucker is, what he did, blah, blah, blah. Uh, you want to crack it open or you want me to, Brian? Speaking oh, of go for it. facts would be perfect. Facts. Yeah, what, what you can prove. Assumptions. Okay. Uh, we began investigating Michael Simone way back in September when we had a sniper that was shooting at people. Uh, his what DNA year? Can you clarify the year? That would be early to, or late 2021. Uh, septem late, uh, so September 2021. Uh, multiple instances of snipers. These are confirmed through his text messages where he was taking photographs through the lenses of the snipers, the uh, the scopes, I guess, and sending them to his friends, threatening to shoot them. Uh, he has text messages where he confirms being responsible for the Chinese vitamins that hit the streets, uh, those unknown pills that were going around, uh, and also claims credit for the metamorphine epidemic that we had. Uh, in January 2016, or sorry, January 16th, 2022, uh, Brian conducted a raid on Michael Simone's house. After uh, he planted a car bomb. Yeah. Uh, police uh, officer. Yeah. Uh, plant, uh, was that confirmed exactly? Mm -hmm. Was there evidence of this? Yes, he, has, he admitted it. He's admitted in his own text messages to at least four or five separate car bombings, uh, including one against me. 
uh, and his DNA has been found on, I believe, three scenes where officers were shot with AWM sniper rifles. Um, he so also both... directly confirmed a remote detonated car bomb about three months after the first one. He also went on to water uh, and uh, essentially confirmed as well as directly called a police officer after the Polito Sheriff's Office was exploded, uh, taking credit for that bombing as well. I mean, it already sounds like there's quite substantial evidence that he's a psychopath. <laughs> I assume he also uh, tried to uh, uh, blow up, uh, what was that, Hayes Auto. <laughs> I bet that was him as well. <laughs> uh, I don't believe that we actually have any concrete evidence linking anyone to that. Oh my god, uh, if they went with Denzel's Ryan, plan, oh, Michael there? was here. <laughs> <clears throat> uh, Hayes Auto, uh, no links. Very unlikely given that. He's a beneficiary oh, of his. Oh my god. It is. Yeah, it's actually a business that's owned by associates of his. Interesting. Um, upon the search and seizure of his property, we found a secret room that had a bunch of gun stashes in the back of it. Uh, boxes labeled explosives and bullets and guns and things like that. And, uh, and we found uh, documentation that led us to a shipping container off of Buccaneer. Uh, down on Buccaneer, we found... Well, it was about... 35 firearms, Brian? Does that sound right? Uh, I think it was much more than that. Yeah. Oh, 35 it, firearms and then multiple explosives. Yes. Uh, 20 pipe bomb explosives, 35 firearms, class 1 and class 2s. Uh, this was when Enterprise wide bodies were fairly common. Uh, as well as, uh, what were the automatic weapons that we found? Because um, about 10 of those were the class 2s that we located down there. Um like a variety of like AKs and shit. Yeah. Um, I believe there was a sniper there too. There was, yes. there was. And an RPG yeah, there as well an... too. Uh, so an AWM sniper rifle and an RPG all nestled in boxes around a uh, what appeared to be a bench for the purposes of weapons manufacturing. Uh, following that raid was when he went on the run, car bombed a bunch of people, blew up the uh, CGI building, blew up the Polito Sheriff's office, uh, shot me in the face with a sniper rifle, uh, all of which he's admitted to in text messages or his DNA was found on scene. Uh, he also conducted a bombing of the court center on January 22nd, uh, 2022. In the hospital. Uh, uh, yes, he attempted to bomb what is now the fire station, but was previously a hospital, as well as two other locations. Dan Faley has more information about that. Um, again, confirmed via text messages that he had between Jenny Hall and multiple other police officers that he was taunting because he believed himself to be untouchable. Mm -hmm. What else did this guy do, Brian? We got, we got well, more. He has a him. nuclear submarine. Oh, yeah, yep. He has been spotted in a nuclear submarine by one individual, and he escaped in a nuclear submarine while police attempted to apprehend him back in December. Or no, sorry, uh, August 2022. All right. Uh, can I ask a question? Absolutely. In Since September of 2021, how many, off the top of your head, how many bombings has he been involved in, like, completely? Whether it be car bombings, building bombings, like, a total amount of bombings he's confirmed been involved in? And then how many, uh... And I, I have the documents for all the all the things you sent, but I just want to hear you, the... Just flat out said. How many bombings has he been involved in? I would estimate that we could directly confirm through DNA and text messages at least 11. 10 or 11. Well, he does sound like a terrorist. <laughs> Super he terrorist. might need to set up a uh, Guantanamo Bay for this man. Or just throw him off the ship. That or we can give him the Napoleon experience. Maybe what experience? Napoleon. Maybe, maybe what we could do is um, we can get our own island. And maybe we can put him in a one-by-one -one cell in this island with no visitors. Yeah, that's what happened life. to Napoleon. He got put on an island. Except in a cell. One by one where he has no visitors. Yeah, it's a soundproof glass container. <laughs> I do sort worry of like that... the guy out of X-Men. <laughs> I, I do worry that it's going to require a lot of resources due to the fact that he's got 
a lot of friends in powerful places that will do anything they can to break them out. And we could put a few turrets that will shoot anything within the vicinity. I'm sure we'll be fine. Uh, Fair. If you're found Please. on the island, you are to be sentenced by death, could also be stated. If you really want to tell people to fuck off. Yeah. Something like that would be good because it gives people um, an understanding that, hey, if you fuck around, you'll find out. Oh, I forgot about the big one. He admitted in his text messages that he was arming the treasonous during the War of Sandy Shores as well. Oh! Oh, those biker assholes. Yeah. Wait a second. You're telling have, me that uh, he... photos of him as well at that location. Mm-hmm. Uh-oh. Now, hold up for two seconds. Uh, you're telling me that he was involved in that whole, uh, that whole thing that, that me and the other senator had to stomp out, that whole war, that mm -hmm. whole treason? Yeah, yeah. Uh, just prior to war breaking out, he was texting about uh, how war pays. Uh, he was photographed in that compound following the kidnapping of an officer. And then directly after the conclusion of the war and everyone being sentenced to treason, he said he was done with it for now because pharmaceuticals paid more. That's when he moved into the space of metamorphine and stuff like that. Mm, interesting. What an asshole. Well, uh, I mean, there's enough information you've passed on. Once we go over the evidence and whatnot, maybe me and the other senator will speak and we'll uh, come to a conclusion on what we believe should happen in the situation. It appears a lot is tied to the Russians as well, and uh, we'll all also have some input on the new island as well. Perfect. Yes, uh, it Chief, will be Chief, Chief Justice Green should have a document with all of our evidence for you. Probably the biggest ones is going to be the compiled phone records because we. Uh, I uh, we, we Green, get me that there. document. I, I yeah. would like to. How, how many pages? Knight, is can it? you uh, can you reforward everything, Knight? Or Bundy? I don't think I don't think it ever got sent directly to me. What don't I um? packet of information yeah all right i'm getting i got it. here you go yep i got you jesus fuck. all right that's the, that's the reason i pointed out the important one because there's a lot of fucking reports there all right senators you asked you received blended That is a lot of, uh, a lot of evidence. It is. All right, it is. I, I can go through that in my spare time. Yeah. A year and a half of investigation, at least. Yes, yes, yes. There should be plenty of information. If we could confirm all this, we'll uh, we'll make a summary judgment and see if there's any bail or anything like that. I guess. <laughs> Perfect. Now let's go back to the homeland and take out these guys in Little Moscow. Of course, yes. Don't worry, I'll have some uh, explosives and utility uh, available soon. All right. Ooh. Hey, can I shoot that uh, gun that you had? That like uh... no. Hey, Bass. Talking about this gun? Uh, yeah. Maya or Winston Walker? Why'd they get fired? <laughs> Um, Winston Walker got fired because he placed a hit on somebody else. Um, Maya got fired for, um, she's not a fit for PD. Do either of them becoming lawyers? Uh, I don't have an objection with um, them being lawyers. I mean, it's your call. All right, I'll review everything. Who did he put a hit on? Air Brown for the clowns. Who? Harry Brown. Oh, Ooh, shit. Wow. oh Harry Brown. Nice. It definitely works. Yeah, right. it does. You can use that on the tuner shop. Can we? Can we? <laughs> can we get some of those for the Russians? Oh no no! It's Senator. It's just, this is Area sixty nine weapons. Oh. Holy shit! So maybe I shouldn't shoot the helicopter. <laughs> yeah, maybe. No, no, no. Tell that cop to stand down. He's the center. Just tell him to stand down right now.
Don't shoot! Do not shoot! What channel are these assholes on now? Before he sent you to the ocean. Before to uh, Lovesick. Gun duty. If you, shoot a, if you shoot a senator, then they're probably gonna put you in a one by one box and just leave you. Remember that. God damn that Patriot. We're gonna wait for the second helicopter. There's a lot of us here. Uh, I'm sure, sure Brian and I can arrange for a pickup from Lovesick or somebody. Yeah, there's actually uh, one more thing I forgot to mention. Um, this is a PV thing we're trying to bring. I just want to hear your input on it. We're trying to uh, also think about bringing back the um, DA's office. It's not going to be mandatory for um, cops, but um, recently uh, we've been getting our ass. The DA's office. The sorry, DA's office. Yeah, sorry, I almost threw up. Did you just say DA's office? Yeah, it's not mandatory, but... A resource well, if you had people. police officers that just had the evidence ready and written up, you'd never need a DA's office. I don't think that's the reason why we lose court cases. The reason we cannot articulate how to build a uh, probable cause without a shadow of doubt in a court of law is something that requires experience and um, more than you know logic. Or training. Yeah, I, I think just simple training could fix that. You if don't you need can't an entire do that office. without a shadow of a doubt, they shouldn't go to jail. It's that simple. Fair, but that's not my job. I'm a police officer, not a lawyer. Oh, it is your job, actually. Yes. No, my, my you job need is to, to, to articulate that. It is literally your job. Otherwise, well, you can't detain somebody. No, fair. I'm talking about in a court of law where they're found guilty, right? Right, right, right. Well, you are the court of law to begin with, you see, when you put them in handcuffs, sir. I'm acting as a... Yeah, look, no. Bass, given anyway, our policies on how warrants work, uh, y'all very much are the da because we know there's a hell of a lot of people that go to jail without ever getting to contest shit so y'all better be right the first time well i don't disagree with you i'm just saying that we're trying to come up with uh, more resources for officers to realize actual trained lawyers that know what they're doing a court of law that could be part of an early investigation and help them build up probable cause so they can prove in a court of law either way listen I don't give a shit about that, okay? I just couldn't care less about fucking DA's officers. All right. I prefer to shoot myself <laughs> in a video game at home. <laughs> then get him a helicopter. <laughs> Fuck you back. Well, uh, y'all still need us, Bass? Uh, I don't believe so. We should be good, actually. <laughs> All right. Well, we'll All right, right, nice All right take care. Call that driver. Hopefully my tank's okay. All right. Hey Max, can you pick us up at the uh, PD? See ya. Like, like it's great. Like, so if that's actually proven in these documents, like. This guy's been investigated since September 2021, confirmed for 11 bombings and involved in treason, created one of the biggest outbreaks. Like, <laughs> why were they consider? Why were judges even considering giving this guy bail, bro? What the fuck? <laughs> so what was the verdict on those cars? Uh, can sell them if it goes through a third party? Well, yes, we should be selling them to local businesses, civilians. Utilize right. them, not people that go to jail every five minutes. Yeah. Perfect. I love hearing that. Holy shit. I'll talk to Mushkins or whatever. talk bass about that car pd wants you you might just might have to go to public auction against everybody else i'm okay with that I, I'm, I'm okay with that i just want to a way to buy uh police work in a way to where people sure it, like that, that argument's so brain dead like, though everybody yeah, does terrorism on the daily like, like shooting at the hospital million, so, so you can bomb 11 buildings and uh, we'll see if you really <laughs> want that or not and it's su it support treason <laughs> <laughs> um, so instead of Mushkins, maybe you could talk to the impound lot or something like that, you know, the actual civilians of the city. Yeah. Alright. Sounds good. 
I believe there's uh, been a few people work there for years on end and not really made much, so maybe they'd be better utilized. Yeah, I like, think uh, also empower Red the Harrington leaders. and them. Yes, yes, yes. All right, I'll talk to Red. Yeah. Okay, that sounds great. Perfect. All right. Hey, do we want to talk about some of this shit now or later? Uh, we could do it later. Fuck that shit. I'll there's have to read through it myself. Read, yeah. yeah, there's a lot of fucking shit to read. I ain't even looked at it yet because, you know, I'm supposed to not look to the court case. But if we're just going to look at it now, then I'll need a couple days too. Uh, as far as uh, as far as little Moscow, I, I think we're on the same page. We just bombed that bitch. Yes, yes, I agree. We just never let move on. Oh, yeah. It's going to be war America. with Russia. I mean, no, uh, we start with this fucking radar tower. Look at that shit. Please. Can we I mean, get a list of all uh, all the right places right. these people have lived at? Do we know anything about them? The Russians? Where they could have oh, lived, who they've been affiliated with? Some of them are dying. So, um, last Friday, we had an attack from the Russians. We had three um, DOAs after the battle we had with them, where we used our helicopters, our jets, and fought in the air. Shot down two jets and one helicopter. Pretty much okay. every, every Russian we've taken into custody has been either eaten a cyanide pill, sniped by their own guy, or shot with a rocket launcher. Okay. Exactly an expectation. And this is, these are the people that Michael Simone was working with? Correct. <laughs> well, I wouldn't say directly, but in the same kind of just a bet. <laughs> this, uh, this russian cell baba yaga that they're calling themselves they appeared directly after michael quote unquote died when he faked his death okay well uh either way yes we'll uh we'll look into it and uh, we'll have something sorted out uh, as soon as possible yeah maybe in the All meantime right. uh just any assets anybody affiliated with this baba yaga cell any assets they have any 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 places they claim any members that are known to be alive Hey, uh, this, uh, Reggie Might motherfucker, uh, Michael Simone's attorney has been bugging me about wanting all the evidence to build his case for his client. Do I just tell him to kick rocks? What do you want me to do? Uh, yes. Is he around at the moment? Nah, he's one of those, uh, Australian some bitches. Don't wake up till like, oh, yes, like yes. six Come hours from now. Balsack and we'll get to him. That's how this works. All right, will do. I'll relay the message. All right, perfect, Senators. Can I drive your tank? Absolutely not. I'll drive that myself Fuck. and uh, get my myself sure. home, I guess. I could yes, be I'm absolutely positive. I got a G-Wagon and a sports car. I, I could be the window. You could be the door. Or you want me to hold on to him and sell him? Well, what, are you, what are you talking about? The cars. You want me to talk to that Red Harrington guy and get him uh, sold at auction, uh, or you want me to give him to you? That I would recommend, uh, Crane, but it's up to the Senate. Uh, as long as they're going to a civilian, if we want to do it that way, or, or I'll hold them until the, it happens, I don't really give a fuck. Okay. Well, I mean, we can just, we just, just make it so, why don't we just do this? I'll set it up with Red, he'll run an auction, and the winner has to be approved by the Senate. There we go. Uh, All right, bro, perfect. so you like that idea? Winner is approved by us, for the and uh, this Red guy will run the auction? Yes, yes, yes. Sounds All right, perfect. we'll give him some kind of cut, like 20% or whatever? Yep. I'll get him paid. Sounds good. I'll talk to him. Oh, sorry, you got pulled away from uh, what you were doing to come out here. Uh, could somebody open the door for us over here? Yeah, I got keys for you guys. I think we do go down one more, yes? One more, one more. Yeah, yeah, so. yeah. Alright, thank you so much. Perfect. Yeah, Kyle Fred. I knew. Oh, uh, nobody stole the tank, Marvelous. Perfect. Perfect. All right, I'll take care of my lunch. Hey, Crane, I think I found yeah. a Vin Scratch tank. Nope, just Senators. Oh, okay. All right, thank you, Shelby. It's a nice tank, uh, your honors. Yeah, oh, let me, yes, let me yes, yes. Oh, well, this gun is inoperable. Oh, oh sorry, sir. Oh, sorry. Jesus. Right. No, I can't. Pump it. Now. 
Hey, um, hey, uh, what, Senators, what if you have a, um, uh, I don't know. Nah, I think it's a one seater. Oh, oh my God, one seater. Oh, okay. Somebody needs to get. Whoever's in this needs to get out. Nobody's in it. I don't think oh. anyone's in it. I shouldn't have said that. Oh. He's a senator. Yeah, okay. probably. Didn't get in now. <laughs> no. <laughs> hey, remember when oh, we there had we a go. Senate appeal and then the senators fired them? I need to just change seats oh, a little bit. Yeah, I remember that. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that was so long ago. Holy shit. <laughs> Stop changing your dick. You get you Brian. Yeah, I'm not, I'm, I'm not moving. On a court case, surprisingly. Uh, uh, GSF medic. What in God's yeah. name? Excuse me, important people coming through. Oh God. Is there a tank? It's not. It's not murder. Oops, window. sorry about the fence. <laughs> Don't worry. <laughs> Ugh. Oh, shit. I have no idea what just happened. Let me open the gate. Should be good. Oop, my, oop. Oh, my. Sorry. You'll need Sorry that. about that. You'll need that. There you go. Oh, thanks, guys. Have a good day. Fuck Russia. Yeah, for real. <laughs> I'm sure we can fix that up. Just uh, pl plug back in the wire. It, 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 right. it would oh, there it is. There it is, right there. Great work, sir. <laughs> Fuck Russia! Russia! Fuck Russia! Slow down or you will be executed! Okay, well, this is time to have a sleep. All right. Uh, we should talk soon about uh, the information once we read over it, sir. Yeah, we should. And then uh, whenever you want to uh, fully wipe out Russia, just call me and we'll take care of that. Thing. Oh, of course. I'll try to get a UFO from Area 69. Yeah. Nice thumbs, by the way. They, they, they look great. Thank you. I might get some myself or some Crocs. I've heard they're comfortable. Hell yeah. You know, you know what would be kind of funny? What's that, What if sir? we got some of their own bombs that the PD seized and we just used them on their own buildings? Not a bad idea. Ooh, what is that? Okay, I'll see you around, sir. Good seeing you yet again. Good seeing you. I'm going to go have an orgy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Classic. God, I love Coil. <laughs> um, why don't you don't divine? 